struck by the Bright Line train. This happened this morning in Pompano Beach, so let's get right out to Local 10 News reporter Syra Onwer. She is live at the scene with the latest details. Syra. Alexis, Christy, it all happened on the tracks right behind me. I just finished speaking to people who witnessed this whole thing happen. Such a traumatic sight to see what they say was a woman walking across the tracks when she was hit. This all happened around 730 this morning. Let's give you an aerial view of this intersection here in Pompano Beach. Right now we know this happened around 730 this morning. Uh, that's when Broward Sheriff's Office deputies responded after a pedestrian was hit by the Brightline train here at Northeast 6th Street and North Dixie Highway here in Pompano Beach. Fire rescue also responded and that woman was pronounced dead on the scene. Detectives with BSO's traffic homicide unit, they were notified and they are investigating this crash. Uh, earlier, those units shut down northbound lanes of North Dixie Highway here and those have since reopened. We spoke to a witness, a teen girl who was in the car with her mother when she she saw the woman crossing the tracks. They, uh, she says she was walking away from a man while looking at her phone. She was walking and she had her head down and she like looked up and then she just got hit by the train and she flung up in the air and I just seen her drop and then everyone like started like running towards her. People were putting cones around her so no one would so run no one over her run because over. people were still like in the car driving past like she wasn't like laying on the floor. A lot of those witnesses still in shock processing what they saw early this morning. Uh, emergency crews have since... Infinite love, life, and good vibrations. This happened not too far from where I live at. That's why I felt it was need. It was an urgent need that I covered this story. Like I tell everybody, those phones are very much distractions. I feel like this is deja vu, y'all. I feel like this... I really feel like today especially talking about this i feel like i just stepped into like i've already talked about this before but i never talked about this before because it's rare that i talk about death on my page i try to keep it with infinite love life and i could get petty sometimes but that's her body up under that yellow top and it's called the bright line i do not want to get on that bright line train i mean what I'm trying to figure out, right, like, was she trying to get away from the guy? Because everybody keeps saying she was talking to a guy and she was walking off and she went up under the guardrail where that lady crossing over at. Where's the man? He had to see it happen too. Why nobody is not questioning him? And I feel so sorry for those people who had to endure that they're gonna have nightmares like they're gonna need some physical therapy real talk they're gonna need somebody to talk to a shoulder to maybe you know like cry on because man i mean wow and today when i left when i took my florida walk because i'm posting up all the video i did i got out kind of early but I didn't know that's why traffic you know earlier was backed up I didn't know that was the reason why because see that that train line that she's behind it go all the way all the way all the way down by where I live at I'm in Fort Lauderdale that's considered Broward too but that's in Pompano Beach Florida that's not too far from where you know Mm -mm -mm. nope 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 that train track is not the one where nah she got hit over there off of dixie highway ah oh, but some of them trains still merge and come over this way mm -hmm. so it, yeah but did i ever see a bright land train run this way no i don't think nah uh-uh that ain't bright land bright land don't run over by where i'm at but either way we have tri-rail and they got they're gonna have to do something about this something has to be done but i don't get it like how in the world like you ain't feel the vibration of the train like omg golly man and she went up under the gate like up under the guardrail you know before i leave i had a cousin named david who climbed on the train and his shoe screen got stuck and he lost his leg so i know he would recommend nobody play with no uh doggone trains i mean she a lady lost her life in which she wasn't playing but she wasn't paying attention and i'm out